Oh. Folks, I conquered Rome. I ended choice. I did everything that I was called to do in the name of freeing humanity in this world from choice. But what happened? I woke up today. I lived maybe 20 years in peace. 20 solid years. We consolidated the empire. We finished off all the factions within and I woke up and I find myself having to start all over again but this time I don't get to choose Athens I don't get to choose anything it's here I'm Epirus I must be Epirus I don't know why this is the only choice that I have and so I I, I venture once again with what whatever is at work has given me to eliminate choice in this land. And I am presuming that it's the same conditions as a, as we had before. But don't worry, we'll be doing some we'll be doing some scout work on that, and uh, we'll see we'll see if my suspicions are correct. We got a little breaking up here. What's going on here? Let's see if uh, we got a little. Breaking up is hard to do. Not sure what's going on there, but I do want to do. Make sure I got all the light on there. For some reason, we're flickering in and out. So that's going to be an interesting element to this video. The flickering in and out of Frico is. It seems maybe it's fitting. So we are going in as Epirus. Epirus it is. So, welcome to Frico Plays God Mode, Total War Rome 2, the Epirus Faction. This is episode one. And in this episode, Frico inherits his paltry kingdom and deals with the fact that he has once again rebooted back to the beginning with nothing but choice everywhere. This time, Frico had no choice but to reemerge in this world, surrounded by clouds. Uh, the Epior Ep Epurians. Your time has come. Recent setbacks in Magna Graecia compelled you to establish power on the Greek mainland. The Spartans think themselves superior to all others. They will know otherwise once you lay waste to their lands. The Athenians have become weak and would rather prattle than fight wars. They will fall in time, but may be of use against their Macedonian masters. The scions of Alexander still fancy themselves worthy of his empire and must be stopped. Perhaps then, a mass invasion of the Italian peninsula. You have unfinished business with Rome and Syracuse. The enemies of Epirus will be subdued. Let's see. Objective issued. Ascent to my bold undertaking. From humble beginnings come great things. Take your first step and establish a foothold from which to launch your people to greatness to the elimination of choice. Objectives. Completely control two provinces, either by direct ownership or through client states and military allies. New bonus objective. Hey, 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 how about we just do this there? Here. Boom. There we go. All right. I don't need your money. You see that? I don't know if you saw that. I went from 6,000 to 900 gazillion. Yeah, because I, I didn't lose my God mode powers. All right. So who are you? Who are you? You're my uh, advisor. All right. Let's see what we got to deal with here, friends. Let's see. Technology will get to you in a second. Let's, let's go here first. So what is our... What is our situation here? So we have here, we are the Malosians. All right. Show deceased. You know what? Don't show deceased. Wait. All right. Show deceased. Whatever. All right. So here we go. Pyrus. Uh, Pyrus. This will be our personification. Pyrus, from henceforth, shall be known as 
Rico. This is me. This is what I look like. I know that you see this visualization of you, but trust me, in our world, I don't look like what you see, although I don't know what you see. I want to be clear. I, as Frico, have no idea what you see. The only thing that I know is that, that where your world intersects ours and you're able to see this, which is fantastic, by the way, uh, I know that I don't look like what I look like in the game, in, in what you call the game. This game is life. This is our life that we're talking about. So here, I am Frico Pyrus. That is me. So I want to work on my little stuff here. So send, send gift to a loyal party to further improve. How about we do that? Let's do that. Let's do that. <coughs> all right. All right. All right. We got We got there. All right. Let's see. Do I have any power to adopt anyone? Let's see. Can I adopt anyone? Adopt. All right. I'm going to adopt you. Yep. Yeah. 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 We're going to adopt you. All right. Let's, let's see. Do a favor. Do a personal favor. No, nah, I don't want to do that. Declare heir. No, I don't want to declare an heir yet. Now, I've got, uh, I got Mademoiselle here. Let's see. Let's see. Your name is, uh, my wife is, uh, you're my wife. Now, the sad thing about this in God mode, my generals live. My, nobody else does. They have a finite period of time with which to live before they die. And so all the ladies die, and it's really horribly sexist looking. And uh, I'm trying to figure out, and hopefully I will in this game, how I can get more ladies over to be generals. So not a bunch of ladies are dead. Plus, it would be cool. I would like to have male and female generals. It would be way cool. Ooh, females into battle. Come on. That's going to be some cool stuff. Cool stuff. Secure promotion. You know it. Ah, influential woman. Let's see. Can we give her another promotion? And now she is a, a Melosi. Oh, she is a... What? What is her... Wait. No. Oh, okay. Opportunistic woman? Dang. That's that's kind of rough, man. Now she is a power hunger woman. Dang. Sexist. I mean, a matriarch. Okay, that's more like it. That's fine. Ah, okay, she's a matriarch. Good. I made her a matriarch. Improve relations. Improve your relations with a member of... Let's uh, let's go with that. There we go. There we go. And uh, send emissary. Let's see. Send a politician to a province. Send diplomat to a diplomatic mission. Let's see. Send. Uh, how about we go there? We're gonna send her to a diplomatic mission. Yep. We sent her off, getting her some experience. I'm sorry that you're dead. Okay. So Troyhas, what can we do with you? So secure promotion. And now you're an influential woman. Now you're an opportunistic woman. Oh, come on. I'm c I'm sorry. Rome Total War. Come on. I mean, um, come on. Power hungry woman? Come on. Matriarch? Matriarch is fine. And we got her to work. Let's organize some games. So let's just do it. We can only do it in Macedonia. So let's get her some organizing of some games. Build her up some political power, hopefully. Alexander! Okay, Alexander, where are your situation? Well, we're going to have to promote you. See, look, you get uh, Agoromamnos. I'm sorry, you could you could just, listen, listen, give people the option. You don't have to, like, rebuild it, you know, but, but give people the option to choose how they want to define their universes. So we can define our males and females the ways that we want, and I want flexibility with all of them. With all of them. I want to be able to do fun stuff. Come on, man. Come on, Rome Total War. Hear me. Hear me. Hear me. Hear me. Hmm. Assassinate. No, nope, I don't want to assassinate. Send gift. You know what? I'm going to send gift to this guy again. I want this guy to love me. <coughs> all right. And uh, let's see. Uh, spread rumors. No, we're not going to spread rumors. Ooh. Ooh. Let me see. Let me see. Can I get you? Yes! I've got him to my cause! He's now in our group! All right! Can I adopt anyone? Olympias. Olympias! Uh, let's see. What's your deal? You've got nothing. Uh, send diplomats. Uh, send emissary. Okay, we're going to send emissary. What the heck? Just get her out there. Get people working. Get people doing things is what I'm talking about. I'm talking about people fundamentally doing things. 
And we got he Helena's. Uh, Helena's is uh, not. Uh, is that a child? Oh, okay, that's a child. That's why. And Davos, Davos, welcome. Yes, welcome, welcome to the fam, Davos. Let's uh, let's uh, let's uh, let's send a gift to this guy. We just want this guy to love us, dude. We love you, man. We love you, man. We love you, man. All right, all right. All right, other notables. Let's see. What's your deal? Where are you from? Tell us in our office. Let's see. I don't know your deal. I don't know. You got one. I, I'm I'm not. I'm going to slowly start to get familiar with these things up here. And this is, uh, yeah, what all this stuff means. But uh, I'm not there yet. I'm not there yet. I'm getting in there slowly, grinding myself in. Let's see. Can I hire a politician? Okay, let's see. Disciples of the Zeus, Disciples of the Zeus. No, no, no. I don't want to do that. I want Melissa, L Melissa, Melossians. Okay, can anybody adopt anyone? Anybody? Can you adopt anyone? Any adoptions available? Pyrus? Come on, man. Why can't you let Pyrus? Me. That's me. Rico. Alrighty then. Alrighty then. So, now, we got that sorturated. Let's uh let's take a summary here. We're, we're we're at a kingdom here. Can we change to anything right now? So kingdom, I'm I'm gonna keep this because I want recruitment slot. I don't want to I don't want to mess with that. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep that the same. Politics there. So I'm looking to secure loyalty here. So we're going to uh, yeah yeah this thirst for power. I just gotta make sure. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go with the purge right away. I'm gonna start off right away, and then I'm gonna secure uh, uh, the loyalty. So I, I just want to send a message that listen, man, listen, I ain't I ain't freaking around. I will literally cut you. I will destroy you. And you, okay, I gotta remember you, CBS. You don't get any significant roles. No, no, no. No, no, we keep that with the the Molossians. So we've got uh, we've got Pyrus. I don't know if I can convert any of these women over to. I really want some of these to be generals. Can I get the women to be generals? That's what I want to know, man. And if somebody has a mod that lets you just do whatever you want, I'd like that. So let's check out our record here. Uh, this the current date is 272 BC, and our current settlement held is just two. And we have unique uh, resources held uh, one, total resources held one. Okay, so we've got nothing. We got nothing. So let's uh, let's check out our diplomacy. So we want to. I think that uh, I want to have immediate relations with Rome. Unlike Pyrus of Epirus, the real guy, I actually want to. Uh, waste time on pleasantries and babble. Speak what you must and be done. I will do this for you. Hold on. I will offer you a payment. Just that. Nothing else. I'm just going to pay them. And I want Rome, by the way. I want Rome to be built up. I want Rome Agreed. to have plenty. I do not expect my fellow Romans to find much joy in this outcome. That's okay. Don't worry, dude. We're fine. You'll see. All right, and then I want to, I don't want to build up Carthage, because screw you. No. As soon as I can, I am going to build up, uh, I think I'm going to build up Parthia. I'm going to build up Rome and Parthia, and possibly one other group. I, I like, I'm going to make me three groups, but I want to make sure they're further enough apart so I give all three of them a fair chance to develop into an empire. And I'll see which ones are the ones that offer me the challenge at the end in an effort to enjoin the universe vis-a-vis -vis choice. So let's check out our military situation. So we have Electra. Now, I really don't know what you do with Electra, but I'm going to just send her in. Can I do that? You know what? Yeah, why not? I'm just going to do it. What the heck? All right. Nah, never mind. Never mind. I'm not going to. I don't know what to do with these things. Spies. Uh, 
So, so I got uh, my ships here. So I can add. Let, well, let me just uh, check out my mercenary availability. I've got dirt on the dirt. And on the uh, available troopers, we have uh, javelin men and uh, javelin men. Oh, man. That sucks. So, uh, fortunately, because of our wealth, we are able to build ourselves a big old fatty, fatty, fatty. I mean, this is a dirt military, and I'm going to call this one. Uh, let's see. Uh, who is uh, Devos is the admiral here. So, let's... Uh, You know what? Let's uh, let's check out who Davos is. I tell you what, I'm just gonna leave you here for now. I want to see where Davos is. All right. All right. Characters here. All right. Where's Davos at? Where is Davos? In my family? Are you in my family? Oh, there, Davos. Oh, Davos is one of us. Davos is one of us. All right. That changes uh, that changes my approach. All right, so I am going to call this details. I'm going to call this the the first assault, and we're going to say uh, I'm going to make sure that uh, I'm going to remember what's the name of my faction again. Malosian. Okay. All right, so we're going to go with first assault. I want to make sure that I know M and then Davos. Okay, because I, I think it's important for us to note that uh, this is the our, our group. We always want to, as much as possible, favor the Malosi infection. We're going to make sure. Okay, so this guy here, what's your story? This is me. This is Pyrus. So we're going to call this... This is the uh, first army mo. I'm gonna call this uh, Frico, because this is me. This is my my unit. So my unit will always be the 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 new the new model army of whatever models we're doing. Oh, good. I'm a horsey. I want to be a horsey. Oh, wow. Well, I'm a Baselius. All right. All right. Oh, man. Melee attack 46. Dees. Decent. Decent. The highest melee attack I could find is, uh, is, uh, uh, well, how many highest melee attack I can find on the horsies? Horsey melee attack I found is, let me get to it here. Come on. Where is it? Where? I got to list it somewhere. Oh, it is the it is our guys that we eventually get available. That that is our Aspis companion cavalry. We have a melee attack of sixty eight. So I'm looking forward to be able to getting that uh, as soon as we possibly can. But right now, we're just looking for some solid. Uh, let's see, the melee attacks thirty four on these guys on the ground. They melee attack thirty, and you don't really have anything other than. And really, then let's see what our our uh, mercenary options are. Um, we've got a lot of mercenary options, actually, a lot. This is pretty solid. Now, these are not the highest level of cavalry that I'm hoping eventually to get. This is a melee of 32. Yeah, th those 32 melees, man. I don't know about that. 37. So we're looking at the Satisan Cavalry here. So we're going to go with uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oh, oh, that's right. I got to. Don't worry. You can't limit me. You can't limit me. And uh, do we have any. Uh, we don't have any ranged archer guys for here. Um, so we're going to go with. Uh, yeah, we're just going to go with, let's see, which one of these uh, is better? That's a 34, 26. And you're a 12, oh, missile damage 20. Oh, that's just, no, I don't care about your, yeah, all right. 
All right, we're just going to fill you up with these guys. So we're, we're not dealing with uh, a lot of options regarding... Uh, you know what? I think that I am going to add more horsies. I'm going to add more citizens cavalry. I think that's probably the decent thing to do. So, so we're going to have you of uh, definitely have to live out your life as a family unit before we can uh, advance to the next pronouns. All right, and this is Eusebius. So let's see where Eusebius is. Where do we find Eusebius? I don't see any Eusebiuses here. So were you Eusebius? Yep. Yeah. 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 Watch what we're gonna do. Let me see. Let me see what's this. We don't want no stinking Eusebius, man. Screw you. You know what? Watch this. Um. All right. I can get rid of all these. Yeah. Disband. You know it. Disbanding units. Yep. Yep. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. That's what we're doing. We're doing that. All right. Now, let's see what Larissa offers. Well, Larissa does have the horsey. But, yeah. Nothing. Not cool, Larissa. All right. Apollonia has. All right. All right. Let's go back to Apollonia, then. And let's build our second army. And I want, uh, okay. Okay, so let's see. Alexander, let's see. Let's go with, uh, go with Alexander. See, you don't give me any, any women as an option. See, I need to have, I need to be able to, come on, dudes. Come on, man. And, and not for any any reasons other than my own. I just I just want to have my options. Okay, just want my options. <laughs> All right. So I am um, I am. Uh, let's see what I have. I have this. Uh, it's a pretty good solid ride. Solid ride. I'm happy about the ride. And uh, now I can label you. I'm gonna name you. Second army, and this is Mo, and this is Al. A L X, Alex. There we go. There we go. There we go. And now let's uh, let's build you up. Let's let's build you up. Build you up. Build you up, Buttercup. I got it. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that to anybody, but it had to be done. All right. So we're going to go with six hoplites, and then we're going to go with uh, just a, you know what we're going to do? I sh You know what? We're going to go with uh, one, two, three, uh, whoop, uh-huh, uh-huh, and then the rest is going to be Citizen's Cavalry, yep, so we got some, so we got some guys. And there we go. There we go. There we go. Yeah, second army. Yep. Yep. Basically, in the beginning, I'm figuring I don't really have any any stuff that I can build or anything. I got work to do on that front, and that's fine. But uh, I think my my cavalry is my answer to that. That that is my artillery, basically. Until further notice, so I'm gonna make sure I got a a, a core of uh, troopers and then cavalry options. And you know what? I'm actually gonna go back to Apollonia here with the first army, and I have here. Okay, so I have a slinger. Yeah, I don't really care. I don't want it. I don't want the slingers. I don't want them. I d I w let's see. I got citizens cavalrys. One, two, three, four. Let's see, I got one left. So I got elephant. Mercenary African elephant. Mercenary Af African elephant. Okay. They're 
they're very good. High damage, large amounts of hit points, average morale. Uh, mm, I I don't know how 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 fast it is, but uh, let me just see. Is that is that a unit that I can I can actually regularly get that Indian War Elephant? That is really fascinating. I got to think about this. What do you guys think? Because I'm thinking, you know what? All right, I'm going to I'm going to start over again. Here we go. No, I don't care about you. Nah, 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 nah. All right, so let's start anew because I I'm I'm now realizing the horse the elephants are like. Okay, so let's start off. I got me. I'm going to go with the uh, these guys first. I want. I think I want to have. I think I want to have four elephants and then I want to have I think six no yeah four no yeah four Tarantine cavalry that's probably good now I got four Tarantine cavalry now I want to go back to my well can I get my soldiers here can I are these guys uh, mercenary hoplite Mercenary Veteran Hoplite's 35. Mercenary Hoplite, 34. Let me just check and see. So this is uh, 34. Uh, okay, so... Wow, so Mercenary... Uh, mercenary Thoros Spears? No, I don't care. I don't care. I know, the range, the range. Mercenary citizen count. Okay, so I'm going to go with uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. And then I got the Tarantine Cavalry. I'm going to go with one, two, three, four. Wait a second. Did I already add the Tarantines and I just repeated that? I did, didn't I? All right, let me uh, let me backtrack on the quarantines because I actually I want the citizens cavalry. There we go. And so then I got one more area that I can fill, and uh, I don't know. I think one more guy. So it was one, two, three, four, five, six, so seven. Seven. So let's go back to Larissa and let's do the same. We're going to start all over again. Sorry, folks, but we're starting all over again. I don't even need any of that guy. I don't need that guy at all. One, two, three. Whoops. Three, four, five, six. Seven. All right. One, two, three, four. This is cavalry. One, two, three, four. Is there a difference between these? Is it just on there twice? Huh. Okay, so wait. Uh, I just realized there's little things here. There's a different factional mercenary. F oh, okay. So, so let's see. Let me just make sure that uh, it's uh. It's my faction. All right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I want to make sure it's my faction. I didn't realize that. That's something I just learned. I got to watch for that. And there we go. We got our four elephants. We got our seven guys and our fours and our fours. And now wait. 
Let me see. Mercenary Citizen Cavalry. Mercenary Citizens Cavalry. Okay, so I don't have a factional, so I got to go with that. All right. All right. Okay, so here we go. What we have here now, we have our second army and our first army. Now we got our first assault. Let me see what it is that I can add to the universe. Uh, I have two armies that I can build and one navy. So I have one more Melosius. So I'm going to make Telesophorus. This is going to be a okay. Very good hull strength. Alrighty then. Nope, average hull strength. All right, that's what I want you to be. All right, now let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got here. Very poor hull strength. Very poor hull strength. And very poor hull strength. Alrighty then. So uh, we have a lot of uh, crap to choose from. So let's just go with our factions and just uh, keep it in the fam. I'm just going to be banking on sheer numbers here. Because really, oh, this is one at a time. This is so cool. This is so cool. You know what? I don't care. Hey, hey, I'm armed. I, I am instantly, like, I didn't even have to build anything. I am already armed. So there's that. Now, I am not... I am choosing not to, for sporting reasons only, not to do anything on this first turn. So, oh, 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 other than build my armies. I do want to build my armies, so we're in Apollos. I mean, uh, I mean uh, not, not to attack anyone is what I've decided. Okay, now, these are disciples of Jews, Zeus people. So now, uh, these people, this is going to be, this is going to be, Man, that, that, that on the ground, 46. You know what? No, 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 that's right. You got to be the backup. So you're going to be basically cavalry. You are going to be pure, hardcore cavalry. So I'm not, I'm not going to put elephants in your units because I want you to be fast. So we're only going to be basically doing, let's see... I guess uh, basically set six each of, and then one of. Uh, I got citizens cavalry, we got Tarantine cavalry and citizens cavalry. So we're just going to do. Okay, we'll do. Five. There you go. There's ten of those, and then uh, citizens cavalry. We'll do. These will be the rest of it. Oh. There we go. There we go. So I'm going to call this. This is. So this is Alexon. This is ZE. So we're going to call this. Uh, Cav1. So this is ZE. That means we know that's the house of Zeus. And this is. Alexon. Alexon. There we go. There we go. Cav 1 Z E Alexon. And now we're going to go back to where are we at here? We're at Larissa. So Larissa here. Let's We're going to raise another one. And basically my cavalry is my support units. And they don't go in. They don't do much uh, other than come in as support. They don't get the glory. 
I'm just going to make sure that these generals, these generals, they don't get the glory. Don't tell them I said any of this. Okay, we're going to go with uh, Dector. Dector, you get to be the... Uh, you get to be the other... Uh, you know what? I got to remember. Yeah, I want to make sure that's my faction that's in your group. That's another good thing to do. It's my faction. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I can't do anything about this. But, uh... So let's call you... We call you D-A-E-T? Okay. So this will be... Cav 2 Z E D A E. There we go. There we go. There we go. Cav 2 D A E. All right. And I think that should be it. I think that we're all filled up. Yep. Yep. Now, see, see how I have this now? I got Cav 1. Now, did I put Cav 1 and first. Uh, ooh, the children of Zeus. Oh, 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 never mind. Hold on. There we go. Cab 2. And first army. <sighs> All right. That's the first army. And that's Cab 1. All right. And that's the second army. And that's Cab 2. And then we have the first assault. And then... Uh, ah. Okay, so I can make you... Oh, I'm going to make sure that you are... All right, tell us upon us. Alexion, Dator, Eusebius. All right. I, I want you, man. Okay. I'm going to put you in... Where's Telesopianus? Okay, so we're going to call this... Uh, yeah, this is going to be uh, first support. And that's going to be uh, an X, which tells me... This this guy's not part of any faction right now, so he's a wild card. He's a wild card, so I'm not willing to put him into a into a into a lead role, and I'm just going to keep him with him for well, actually, for security reasons. I'm going to take him on down. Oh, I can't really do anything to protect Larissa. Never mind, Larissa's not doesn't have a C thing. Okay, so here we go. I am going to save this as Epirus 272 BC. All right. And we're going to hit the resume game. We're going to hit the, the oh, 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 not yet. Oh, man. All right. Let's uh let's unlock uh, technology here. So we're going to hit the end turn and we're going to see what happens here. I humbly ask that you at least consider a formal treaty. Strong defenses need good foundations. I I'm willing to consider this at present and I'm willing to pay him. Your willing. acceptance here will bring much satisfaction to my people. Hey, I appreciate it. Magnificent Athens, Athens wants a non-aggression pact. Price. And our price must of necessity be high. I'm I'm willing to do this right now. I'm willing to have a little peace right. Oh, I cut him off. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm I'm actually okay with that. I am absolutely totally fine with that. So, I mean, I appreciate I appreciate the power structures uh, within. So, uh, let's see. A new political intrigue has development. Your, di your diplomat has betrayed you. Penalty to all income from trading. 
Okay, well, that I'm going to have to deal with that. Target faction accents. I don't know what's up with that. Oh, uh, this character's mission has failed, Troyus. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. This character's mission has ended. And I've completed a technological advancement. Now, the char this character has returned home from military command and will engage in faction politics until called upon to lead your forces once again. Yeah, well, I don't want you to. I, I, I don't want you to, okay? I just don't want you to. And with that, I'm going to end this episode of uh, Freako Plays uh, God Mode. In, uh, this is uh, Total War Rome 2 Emperor Edition. This is Epirus Faction, uh, Episode 1.